Let's hear how bulletin boards and other nutrition education strategies strengthen the culture of wellness at Pelican Elementary School. Board, when you go into the um, into the cafeteria, there's a bulletin board. You can get a picture of it. Right now, it's about uh, exercising. Um, it's got lots of hearts on it because it's the month of February. I really appreciate you guys changing it up and, and uh, changing the message because then the kids look at it, particularly because they have to walk right by it when they go into the lunchroom. And when we do the taste testing, usually once a month, it's set up right there where the kids wash their hands, use sanitizer, get a, a taste test, and then they go into the lunchroom. And it doesn't. It makes good conversations. And then when you have a classroom party, the Valentine's party, a Christmas party, whatever it might be, um, or some kind of reward, and they use, maybe they don't use food, but if they do use food, they're much more mindful about what they serve. Mm -hmm. It's not cakes and cupcakes and sodas and all that. It is, you know, it's cheese sticks, it's carrot sticks, it's fruits and vegetables, it's a, a yogurt parfait that they might have gotten to learn how to make it in class. Mm -hmm. um, it's the fruit kebabs. Um, that's great. And that, that's some of the carryover that happens in the classrooms. And and not only that, but um, when we have a carnival, or we have open house, or we have a walk-a-thon, or, um, or the activity-a-thon, rather, or we have walk-to-school days, OSU is always there to partner with us. So. Mr. Swan recently applied for the Oregon School Wellness Award and acknowledged the valuable contribution OSU's nutrition education program has on school-wide wellness at Pelican Elementary School.